गुरुदेव गते गुरु देव भजे गुरु नई बस हास्वी नमो गुरवे न गुरो परम शिशु रश्मि गुरोर्मति रस्ति गुरो मम पाहि गुरो ब्रदीमि संस्कृत वाचा ध्याया संस्कृत हृदा कुर्वे सेवांचकाये न वंदे संस्कृत मातर यौनर संस्कृत व्योमि ख्याल रमते मुदा संस्कृति संस्कार we were planning to cover today so let's move forward to the class we first start with the vyavaharika shabda <coughs> so let us see so first is you have the words given in english and you have to write the sanskrit words for these english words so adho datta nam adho datta shabda nam sanskrit bhashaya artham likhata <clears throat> write the sanskrit equivalent of the following words so let's see what we have first urmila mahendra babu urmila mahendra babu good evening madam good evening oh chair chair is asandaha asandaha one more <clears throat> torch a uh, torch uh, is garadeepah नमस्ते vyajanam vyajanam samye one more broom sammarjani sammarjani samye dhanyavad ha dhanyavad v srinivasan <coughs> Namaste bhagani. Namaste. Yeah. Uh, flower was hmm? Pushpa Dhani. Pushpa Dhani Dhakarasya Mahaprana asti. Yeah. Pushpa Dhani. Dhani, yes. Dha dha dhani. Dha, I said dha only, I don't know. <laughs> dha dha, it's a Mahaprana. It's a, uh, the voice is not, the Mahaprana yeah. is not can you pronounce alpha prana and maha prana dakara both uh, one after the other then i'll be able to dis, uh, make out the difference da da no da and dha da and da da dha da dha i would no no both are sounding the same oh <laughs> that's why i asked It is a da 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 da. Mm-hmm. You need to work on it. Please listen to any of the pronunciations that we have done in the earlier class or Bindaji's pronunciations. Da and da. Are you able to make out the difference when I say it? Yes, yes. I am able to make the difference. So I thought I am pronouncing uh-huh. it rightly only. That is what I. Uh... <laughs> no, no. Da Mahaprana. Why I am saying is this da ni. comes from dudhanya dhatu the okay. dhati okay the dhati is to hold yeah so pushpani are the dhati the one that holds flowers is the pushpadhani pushpadhani dhani dha 
ஜலி <laughs> Yes. So, Kara Deepa is something that, uh, a, a source of light that you hold in, that, in your hand, which will be a torch. Oh, Kara Deepa, huh? Yeah. And this is yeah. uh, Pushpa Dhani. Pushpa Dhani, Aadhaya means to take. Okay. Something that takes the flowers. Okay. Yeah. Next to what do you want to take? Umbrella, <coughs> Tatram. Tatram, again, Mahaprana syllables are not... very uh, clear chatram chatram, chatram. no it's the same alpha prana only is coming you oh. need to work on it uh, mahode there are a whole lot of um, uh, courses where the elementary pronunciation is taught from the umar okay. sir okay do look at the website and uh, please keep practicing it's very important and okay. play your own uh, audio back so what you should do is record it in the mobile and play it back when you hear your pronunciation you will be able to know where you are going wrong okay okay i will try that dhanyawad ha thank you next one and no i will call somebody okay thank you dhanyawad i will call you yes yeah. suman bala namaste ek minute suman bala the next word is here for you on the screen red red shayya shayya so please note shayya is an akaranta three linga padam chhatram is napumsaka linga same way when you go to these words <coughs> karadipah is uh, pullinga chhatram is napumsaka linga okay so that way yeah so this is shayya is three linga padam almira <coughs> agni petika agni petika agni is fire petika is a box so that's how the word comes really nice. and when it says three linga padam mirror darpana darpana mirror darpana what do you think is a linga it is pulinga pulinga samye dhanyavad ha yugal mahoday <coughs> Jugal Mahode, I requested you to unmute. Are you on? Are you on? Yeah, this is the next word. <coughs> Can you see the word on the I screen? Hmm. This has come many times know. in the paper. Sami karaha. Sami is to even it. Sami karoti iti sami karaha. It evens out the wrinkles, right? See, how you have to remember sami karaha is samam is what equal. So, it evens out the clothes. That's what an iron box does, right? It evens out your creases. Good name. Sami karaha. Yeah, yeah. Lock. Tala. Tala. ஆங்கிலாஷாயம் அர்த்தம் லிக்கு 
write the english equivalent of the words yeah <clears throat> yeah so who's coming forward one second oh i'm sorry saya ji saya bhagini kankatam kom kom next one javanika curtain javanika rasmika yes javanika javanika curtain this uh, and, in in surya satakam there's a very beautiful description of the doll <clears throat> So Mayura Kavi has written Surya Shatakam in which he says in the morning it is as though there is a very a star studded dark color curtain with Nakshatrani Shikharasti and that curtain is moving and light is coming in. So you know the passage of the light and the, the break of dawn he describes very beautifully in so that's where the Javanika word comes. Dhanivada, was there anything else you wanted to tell me? Mahodaya, uh, any, any uh, way we can remember this Javanika name? Javanika name. I have to check the Vyutpati of the word. Not that I remember. I have no to check problem. the Vyutpati. Even I don't know the Vyutpati of Javanika. I'll find out. <laughs> so yeah, <laughs> Thank sometimes you. we just have to... What you should do is you should try to keep some uh, other mnemonyms or you know something like that and uh, associate it with something else and remember. Wherever I remember the Gitpati, I'll tell you this I don't recollect the Gitpati. Let me just look at my notes and uh, wow. I'll, I'll, I'll let you know. Yeah, then you are. Padmaji. Ram Ram Bhai. Ram Ram Ram. Yeah. Upadhanam. <coughs> Upadhanam. Pillow. Mm. Pillow. So, Adhana. Dha is Dharana. Something that holds. Upa is an Upasandra. So, your pillow holds your head. That is why it is called Upadhanam. Yeah. Thank Next you. one. Kunchika. Ki. Mm. Kunshika is the key. Sanya, Dhanyavada. Jyotsna ji. Jyotsna bhagini. Namaste bhagini. Can you hear me? I can hear you. Pinjaha. Pinjaha is switch. Pinjaha is switch. Next one. Avakarika. Avakarika is dustbin. Dustbin. Sanya. Dhanyavada, huh? Sri Lata Ji? Sri Lata Bhagini? Namaste. Namaste. Padashodhana. Uh, hmm. Foot rug. Yeah, doormat foot rug. So, why foot rug is because Pada is your feet okay. and Shodhanam Shuddha, you have this word Shuddha, right? Is to clean. So that which cleans your feet, that's why it is foot rug. Yeah, Siyutaha. That. This is, this is come many times. Yeah. Dhanyavad, huh? So let's have some, let, yeah, let's have some more people who have not attempted, then it's the same uh, set of students who are responding. Can we have some more people come forward, please? Sita Raman Mahode? Sita Raman Mahode? Sita Raman Mahode? Because yeah. you told me. Uh, chulli. Uh, hmm. Or oven or stove. Oven or stove. Next word. Sorry. Durabani telephone. Yeah. And a uh, mobile is? Jangama Duravani. Jangama Duravani because Gam means to move. That is why Jangama Duravani. Gam. Yeah, Dhanyavada. Huh? Yeah. And we need yourself. 
now we move on to prahelika so let's have some more people come forward please <laughs> sanjeev mohode namaskar <clears throat> namaskar would you like to read the reading or would you like to do the anuchanam i'll uh, read and then i can give the yes please yes please dante dante heen heen ha shila heen ha शिलाभक्षी parapadena gachati yeah so that which has no teeth but mm. eats stone mm. uh, that which is lifeless but makes a lot of noise and that which is endowed with you can say qualities or uh, many knots and stitches uh, right. but move on others feet and uh, therefore the the answer to the riddle is uh, padaraksha रूढ़ प्रयोग सो ओवर जेनरेशन इफ अटन थिंग हेज बीन यु नो स्पोकन एज अ स्त्रीलिंग पदम then it takes on a strilinga so sometimes there is very no logic as to why a word is uh, pulling or strilinga in that case you go by the rudha prayoga and if the rudha prayoga is in strilinga then you will take the word as strilinga pad good as the as the samya very good thank you you may kindly mute yourself we'll move to the next one the shloka so ma'am has done only one shloka so uh, we will do that pushpadhani okay pushpa no your text the textbook is pushpadhani i am reading from the textbook only binu ji it is pushpadhani there is an akara in it okay yeah we will do that uh, yeah yeah we will do that uh, uh, yeah binu mode yours is uh, what is the uh, this thing it is sanskrit to which language malayalam 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 ha malayalam okay so, okay because yes. in the english uh, sanskrit book it is given as adani pushpadani okay i will correct mm, yeah. thank you yeah so i'm wondering i'll correct yeah, yeah. <laughs> thank you so <clears throat> much any other language if it is a, if is it different can one, any of you put it in the q and a if you have any other language other than malayalam and english say kannada telugu tamil or marathi or something and if it is different can you just check and let me know then we we will uh, know actually whether it is pushpadhani or pushpadhani per se in the meaning it should not really make a difference in the samasta okay. padam both of them should be correct i i don't see okay, oh, okay. Uh, it going to be making a difference in that but in let's telugu, just check yeah in telugu it is pushpadhani madam pushpadhani okay okay so i think okay. i i think it should be pushpadhani and there is a typo that's what i feel yeah संतान गोपाल कृष्ण महोदय संतान को बालकृष्ण महोदय सो श्लोक आंग्ल भाषा लिखत सो दिस इज द श्लोक विच इज बीन डन इन द्लास आई वुड रिक्वेस्ट यू टू रीड इट अलाउड एंड देन एक्सप्लेन द मीनिंग इन इंग्लिश जेय सदा सविक्र मंडल मध्यवर्ती नारायण सरसी जासन सन्नी 
கேயுரவான் மகர குண்டலவான் கிரீட்டிஹாரி இரண்மை வகு துத சங்க சக்கர சம்யக் மீனிங் ஹேஸ் சதா திங்க் ஆஃப் ஹிம் ஆல்வேஸ் ப்ரே டு ஹிம் ஆல்வேஸ் சவித்ர மண்டல இன் தி மிடில் ஆஃப் தி சோலார் சிஸ்டம் மேபி சோலார் ஆர்பிட் யா சோலார் ஆர்பிட் யா இன் தி மிடில் நாராயண நாராயண சரசி ஜாசன சிட்டிங் ஆன் லோட்டஸ் மக்கரவான் makara kundalavan makaram is fish like thing and kundalam is also another jewel on the right earring no 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 fish shaped ear earring ear okay. ornament aha uh-huh. fish shaped kundala kundala is a earring yes yes a and a ear earring. ornament is a kundala so makara makarasya aakriti asti mm-hmm. tasya kundalasya makara iva uh, aakriti asti it is shaped like a makara yeah uh-huh. so if you see the idol at uh, pandharpur hmm. the pandharpur idol also has those fish shaped earrings if uh-huh. you see hmm. yeah then kiriti kirita is your crown crown yeah hari 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 yes yes ti ti hari hiran maya means golden vapu vapuhu means body Hmm. Yeah, continue, continue. Okay. Dhrita is holding Shankha and Chakra. He is holding Shankha and Chakra. He is holding Shankha and Chakra. So, your deduction is correct, how you have deduced the meaning. But you need to just put it in the, uh, uh, this thing, structure it into a uh, sentence in the correct sequence and the, this thing. Yeah. Dhanne vada ho mo dhe. So, with this, actually, we have completed the exercises. Now, we have some fun activity. so we have a surprise uh, test or puzzle or game for all of you so we will do that sanjeev mahoday wanted me to do page 127 from the uh, this thing textbook we will do that kindly give me one minute please sorry yeah so you can see on the screen a series of numbers 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 so raise your hands and as you raise your hands i'll call you one by one you get to choose a number whatever is the word given behind the number you have to give the complete uh shabda roopa of that word like say for example you choose a particular number and rama shabda is written over there so the pratipadikam will be given you have to give the complete shabda roopa of rama so rama 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 ramam rama raman ramena rama abhyam ramaihi and so on till rameshu saptami bahuvachanam okay so if all of you are game we will move forward with this particular quiz ओके छाया जी करो डुकन्य करणे क्र इज एन उभयपदी धातु सो बोथ फॉर्म्स विल बी देयर ओके सो लेट्स फर्स्ट फिनिश दिस ओके या सरिता जी सरिता गर्ग ओके आई चूज नंबर 5 नंबर 5 ओके व्हाट इज द वर्ड विष्णु विष्णु हो विष्णु विष्णवः हे विष्णु हे विष्णु हे विष्णव विष्णु विष्णु विष्णव बहुवचन द्वितीय बहुवचन किष्णु विष्णु विष्णु विष्णुभ्या विष्णुभि विष्णुभ्या विष्णुभय 
पर्टिक्युलर प्रातिपदिक गिवेन इवन इफ इट इज नॉट द स्टैंडर्ड वर्ड गिवेन इन युअर टेक्स्ट बुक यू हैव टू एक्सट्रापोलेट द pattern and take down the vibhakti for that particular word okay so that's how you go about with it yeah vatsala ji you want to attempt yeah i will try yeah choose number, your number number 4 4 vani so first thing you should do is ah. identify whether it is a pullinga strilinga or napumsaka linga shabda then yeah. identify what is the ending and then you should go with your uh, shabda rupa vani is a sri linga shabda ha huh? yes so it will follow which shabda uh, lata mati is lata mati. and vani the same no mati mati shabda ha huh? mati is what is the spelling difference in mati and vani uh, vani uh, e e चेंज इन पैटर्न बिटवीन मती एंड नदी करेक्ट ओके सो नाउ यू हेव टू थिंक ऑफ नदी and hmm. do the declension of vani so do the declension of vani now <coughs> nadi nadyau nadya no do vani shabda you are doing oh. vani shabda <coughs> okay what is on the vani. screen vani hmm hmm vani 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 no vanyam nadyau no is it nadi now no vanyam one year hmm huh. hmm man can we have where can i find that uh, vani shabda i don't think we are written it right vani shabda see this is what i'm saying you know huh. nadi shabda gauri shabda every huh. word is not going to be given when you see the word you should know it is dirga ee karanta it will follow the pattern of nadi shabda nadi shabda has been taught to you you have to use the same pattern and apply it to vani every single word will not be given this is how you learn the language mm. so do you want to attempt uh, i will i will attempt the next one i'll try and see where the vani shabda i have written nadi shabda huh? vani shabda is not given vatsala ji nadi no, shabda I, is given I you have to search for nadi shabda, shabda and apply I'll... the logic to vani shabda i'll search for the nadi shabda and come back and let, let somebody take up the uh, okay. i'll okay. it may be a different word when you come back i hope yeah. that's okay yeah, yeah krishnaveni yeah, sure. kulkarni can you mute yourself vatsala ji krishnaveni yes. kulkarni yes namaste namaste can you attempt vani shabda please yes once more yeah. go ahead vani vanyo vanya ha hmm vani hmm. vanyo वाणीभ्याणीभ्याणीभ्याणीभ्याणीभ्याणीभ्याणीभ्या ऑलवेज इन स्त्रीलिंग पदम 
you have to soften it during sambodhana so hevani will be the sambodhana like when you say now your name is krishna bhagini but when i address you i will say hari om bhagini with a hrasva ikara this is very very important in uh, sanskrit bhasha okay very good attempt krishna ji uh, yeah can you mute yourself we'll move forward Yeah. Who else is coming forward? Anyone who hasn't attempted would like to come forward. Shaji. Namaste, ma'am. Namaste. Yeah. I have choose number eight. Number eight. Okay. Yeah. Adas shabda in pullinga. Adas. In pullinga. Hmm. But Adas is the uh, Trishulinga issue. It is not Samanam in Trishulinga issue. Asau Amu Ami. And in Sri Linga, it is Asau Amu Amu. In uh, this thing, in Apumsaka Linga, it is Adaha Amu Amuni. Amun Amu Amuni. 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 Sorry. So this is not same in all the three lingas. If you have your textbook with you, I have the textbook, but uh, I don't know this. Page two ten. Can you please open page two ten? Yeah, yeah. I'm on on that page itself. It's aso yeah. amu. Can you see four point seven? Yeah. Yeah. Aso amu ami amu amu amun amuna amu bhiam amu bhihi amush 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 ma. रीडिंग फ्रॉम द टेक्स्ट बुक राइट या Correct. Can you see where there is hrasva ukara and dirgha ukara? Yeah, yeah. You need Amubhyam. to pronounce those yeah. clearly. Amu bhiam, ami bhiha, amu shya, amu yoho, ami ami sham, amu amu shmin, amu amyoho, amu yoho, amu yoho, amu yoho, ami shu, ami shu, samyak. so we need to practice this obviously yeah. that is why it's a surprise test i very deliberately did not put it i thought i will just uh, you know we'll just do it in class dhanyawad no, thank you you just said yeah no problem anyone else who hasn't attempted would like to come forward to attempt can i try now madam myself yeah. you can sir ah uh, yugal mahoday please wait i'll just call vatsala ji she wasn't able to attempt last time so let me just call her yeah and request everybody else to please mute yourself prasarant no uh, you want to choose number 1 yeah yes kavi shabda is it pullinga or strilinga uh, kavi is uh, ikarant uh, pullinga shabda samyak so it will follow which word uh, kavi ah kavi is like which word which word in pullinga hari shabd hari okay see this is the correlation that i want you to make that mm -hmm. is why i have consciously given words which are not there oh <laughs> when you see a word you should be able to correlate it to which word which is the mm -hmm. samanya shabd that you have practiced otherwise what's the point in learning the uh shabda roop was right so i so, similar to hari shabda i would say you use kavi now yeah so now kavi shabda you have to decline it like hari shabda so can you attempt it yeah kavi hi hmm kavi kavayah hmm he kavi he kavi he kavayah kavi kavi kavina hmm kavina kavina kavi kavibyam hmm kavibhi 
कवये लिंग ऑफ द वर्ड Okay. You should yeah. know that mati being a three linga shabda, it is yeah. declining differently. Kavi being a four linga shabda, it is declining differently, and it is following kari shabda. Okay. Uh, very interesting yeah? way to understand now. Thank you, madam. So no, this this is the way. It's not like a different way that is being taught. This is exactly how you learn Sanskrit Bhasha. Yeah. Kindly mute yourself. I'll move forward now. Please mute yourself, Vatsala ji. मैम कैन आई आस्क वन थिंग यस प्लीज षष्टि एंड सप्तमी विभक्ति विवचनम फॉर कवि शब्दम इट इज इज लाइक कवयोह और कवयोह का वा योह और कवयोह कवयोह हो के भी का वा योह ओके या थैंक यू हो या ओके यस जुगल महोदय यू वांट टू अटेम्प्ट वन वर्ड जुगल महोदय अस्ति वा जुगल महोदय हाँ चूज योर नंबर पुलिंगे द्वौ अस्ति सामान्यतः सामान्यतः केवल संख्या यदा वक्तव्य तदा पुलिंग वचनम पुष्पम पुष्पे पुष्पानी पुष्पेण पुष्पाभ्याम पुष्पेण पुष्पेण इति उच्चारण स्पष्टतया भवेत महोदय हां पुष्पेण पुष्पाभ्याम पुष्पैः पुष्पैः ऐ कर ऐ आंग्ल भाषायां यदा अहम ऐ इति वयम वदामः खलु आई आई हम्म लाइक दैट आई हम्म वदतो एक निमेश मोदा एक एक निमेश हम्म हम्म हेलो हां वेद प्रकाश सर हम्म हम्म ओके ओके थैंक यू हरि ओम हां यू बस वदतो हां तृतीयुष्पाष्पाष्पाष्पाष्पाष्पाष्पाष्पाष्पाष्पाष्पाष्पाष्पाष्पाष्पाष्पाष्पाष्पाष्पाष्पाष्पाष्पाष्पाष्
सम्यक् उत्तम पैटर्न सी वेदर इट इज अर्वनाम शब्द और वेदर इट इज एन आकार स्त्रीलिंग शब्द इट इज गोइंग अ लिटिल सिमिलरली yaha is coming in the end so these are where the places where you have to observe the pattern of declension of the words mm. you getting it yes, okay dhanyawad yes. let me finish this particular exercise otherwise nobody will know what's behind the other words anyone else who hasn't attempted so far and would like to come forward okay <clears throat> okay anuradha bhagini sl anuradha astiva Yes. Choose your word. Choose third one. Buddhi. Buddhi. Is it pullinga, strilinga, napumsakalinga? First. Mm, I think it is napumsakalinga. It is not napumsakalinga. It is strilinga. It is strilinga. If buddhi is strilinga shabda, then which shabda will it follow? It will follow mati, mati shabda. Excellent. It will follow mati shabda. So now that you have learned mati shabda, apply it to yes. buddhi and do the declension of buddhi shabda. Okay. Hmm. Buddhi he, buddhi, hmm. buddhi ya ha. Correct. Hmm. Is it correct? Hmm. I will tell hey, you. Don't worry. Hey. Go ahead. Hmm. Hey, buddhi. Hmm. Hey, buddhi ya ha. Hmm. Buddhi. Hmm. Buddhi. Buddhi. In Dvivachana, most of the time it's the Dirga Ikara. Yeah. Yes, yes. Mm. Buddhi, Buddhi, mm. Buddhi, mm. Buddhi, Yam, Buddhi, mm. Bihi, mm. Buddhi, Buddhaye. Now here, Mati Shabda, mm. one second, Anuraja Ji. Remember, mm. for the Chaturthi, Panchami, Shashti, and Saptami Vibhakti, there are two forms so those two forms you have to write in the exam okay. so matyai and mataye are there okay. so buddhyai and buddhaye buddhaye will be the form yeah buddhyai buddhaye hmm buddhipyam hmm buddhipyah hmm buddhyaha buddhehe hmm buddhipyam सप्तमी एक I remember earlier also I had given you this clue for the hraswa ikaranta strilinga shabda. How will you remember the two forms that are there in chaturthi, panchami, shasti, and saptami? These four ekavachana forms will have two forms. One form will follow the pullinga hari shabda pattern. One form will follow the Three linga nadi shabda pattern. That's how you have to remember the form. So hare he is pull linga, nadya ha is three linga, and khrasva ikaranta shabda will take like for example buddhi shabda will take buddhya ha 
और बुद्धे है ऑल्टरनेटिवली नो चेंज इन मीनिंग बोथ कैन बी यूज इंटरचेंजेबली बट दिस इज हाउ यू रिमेम्बर दैट वन विल फॉलो पुलिंग हरी शब्द वन विल फॉलो स्त्रीलिंग हरी शब्द फॉर द ह्रस्व इकार शब्द दिस इज वॉट यू नीड टू रिमेम्बर सम्यक अनुराधा भगिनी कैंडली म्यूट यू सेल थैंक यू वेरी मच हरे हरे महोदय एक प्रश्न पृछामी वा मोदे मोदे कथम जाना में कि बुद्धि स्त्रीलिंग अस्ति या पुल्लिंग न्यू वर्ड यदि कारांत अस्ति चेत कथम जाना में कि प्रैक्टिस अस्मिन स्तरे अस्मिन स्तरे बाय यूज एंड बाय प्रैक्टिस ओनली एट दिस पॉइंट ऑफ टाइम लाइक आई वी कीप सेइंग राइट शक्ति बुद्धि प्रीति कीर्ति These are all words which are formed by the application of a pratyaya called ktin pratyaya. It is really too much for explanation at a pravesha level. But because of the ktin pratyaya, there is a sutra called striyam ktin. Therefore, all these words are uh, strilinga shabdas. But at pravesha level, it is only through familiarization that you will know. Now itself, I am saying right that shakti, buddhi, mati, priti, kirti, all these are strilinga words. so you have to take it like that as you go forward in higher levels when you understand this huge world of kridanta pratyayas then slowly slowly we start learning it's a gradual process there's no shortcut yeah kindly mute yourself uh, yugal mohode suman ji suman bala <clears throat> suman ji estiva yeah hmm. would you like to select a number I can hear you, Sumanji. Six, six, six. Huh? Easy one. Uh, it's the uh, uh, like uh, Ram Shabda. Ram Shabda. Yes. Akar Anta Pullinga Krishna Shabda ha. Hmm. Rama ha Rama Rama ha Krishna ha Krishna ha. <coughs> हे कृष्ण हे कृष्ण हे कृष्ण 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 कृष्णा कृष्ण 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 सम्यक उत्तम सी यू गॉट इट धन्यवाद प्लीज म्यूट युअर सेल्फ द लास्ट वन इज नॉट मच ऑफ अ चॉइस रियली या हू वॉन्ट्स टू कम फॉर्वर्ड Sita Raman ji, would you like to attempt this? Yes, Modi. Yes, Modi. Yeah. So it's really not much of a choice, but shall I just click on it? Yes. Asmat shabda. Asmat shabda ha. The car anta ha. Trilling, trilling, trilling. Yer saman ha. Asmat shabda ha. Aham, awa, vayam, maam, ma, awa, awam. मया मह्यम मह्यम मे मह्यम मे मेवयो अस्मा 
अस्मिन धन्यवाद uh we will do the ikaranta pullinga pati shabda which uh, i think uh, uh my, i think it has got missed out by mistake in the uh, one of the earlier classes so we will do pati shabda can somebody come forward to do the ucharanam i'll look at the q and a after that there is one question by shilata ji i will explain that yeah and uh, there is sanjeev kakkar's query also which i will explain but let's finish this pati shabda first so who's coming forward to do pati shabda पुलिंग पति शब्द अनुचारण पतिभ्यापति पत्ये पतिभ्याम पतिभ्या पत्ये पतिभ्याम पतिभ्या पत्ये हो पतिभ्याम पतिभ्या पत्ये हो पतिभ्याम पतिभ्या पत्ये हो पत्यो हो पतिनाम पत्ये हो पत्यो हो पतिनाम पत्ये हो पत्यो हो पतिशु पत्ये हो पत्यो हो पतिशु ओके नाउ वी विल डू द एंटायर थिंग वंस and you repeat the entire one after i finish it okay okay ikarantah pullingah pati shabdah pati hi pati patayah he pate he pati he patayah patim pati patin patya patibhyam patibihi patye patibhyam patibihi patyo patibhyam patibhyah patyo patyo ho patinam patyo patyo ho patishu पुलिंग पति शब्द पति पति पत हे पते हे पति हे पत पति 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 पत्या पतिभ्या पति पत्ये पतिभ्या पति पत्यु पतिभ्या पति पत्यु पत्यो पतिना पत्यो 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 पतिषु hari sorry i take a break here yeah. so why are we when there is hari shabda for ikaranta uh, pullinga hari shabda pati pati shabda is different why is pati shabda different because when pati shabda is a stand alone shabda it is following this particular declension however <clears throat> when pati shabda is part of a samasta padam like you have ganapati vidyapati shripati bhumipati okay rashtrapati whenever it is coming as a compound word the name for compound word is samasta padam in a samasta padam the pati shabda will follow hari shabda so there it will be ganapati hi ganapati ganapatayah he ganapate he ganapati he ganapatayah okay uh, 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 hari so uh, ganapati um, uh, ganapati ganapatin okay then it will be ganapatina ganapati bhyam ganapati bihi so like harina it will be ganapatina <clears throat> panchami is uh, uh, this thing uh, then it is ha haraye so uh, pataye the difference in chaturthi 
in pati shabda stand alone it is patye but in a samasta padam it will be pataye okay there is only one exception where you can see though it is a stand alone pati shabda it is becoming it is following the compound so ramaya rama bhadraya rama chandraya vedase okay ragunathaya nathaya sitaya pataye namaha it should have been pataye namaha but it is arsha prayoga it is sitaya pataye namaha there is only place where the stand alone pati is getting pataye but otherwise when you and i write pati shabda chaturthi will be pataye okay stand alone is patihu but when it is with ganapati for example then it will be hare he so ganapate he that is what is unique about this pati shabda which is why we learn pati shabda as an exceptional shabda okay and uh, this is the declension for you so i hope that clarifies the doubts on pati shabda now we will go to the doubts that are been that have been asked in the class mode ek bar puna badal to no कंबाइनिंग विथ समथिंग एल्स so rashtra shabda and pati shabda come together to form rashtrapati so pati is not stand alone is it clear when pati is a stand alone shabda this is the declension of pati shabda but when pati shabda is part of a samasta padam like ganapati maha ganapati rashtrapati bhumi pati bhupati vidyapati dhanapati whatever pati that time it will follow hari shabda pattern so hari shabda what is different harina tritiya vibhaktim kim asti rupam asti harina harina haraye haraye so pataye pataye okay maha ganapataye namaha okay ganapate he rashtrapate he राष्ट्रपते हे वचनम सो वेन यू से इन षष्टी ओके राष्ट्रपते हे वचनम राष्ट्रपते हे भाषण अश्रुवा जना उत्साह और जना मनसी उत्साह उत्पद्य राष्ट्रपते हे वचनम श्रुवा जनाना मनसी उत्साह उत्पद्य सो राष्ट्रपति नॉट राष्ट्रपति सो पति इज षी वेन इट इज अंड अलोन पति शब्द बट वेन इट इज अमस्त पद मिडल फॉलो हरी शब्द इज इट अंडरस्टूड धन्यवाद हाँ कैंडली म्यूट यूर सेल्फ नाउ देर इज अ क्वेश्चन रमति एंड विरमति ओके रमते रम धातु इज टू बी इन टू इट इन अ स्टेट ऑफ ब्लिस ओके सो वेन यू से रमते यस्मिन योगी इति राम यू से वन इन हूम yogis and satpurushas find bliss ramate when you add an upasarga v to the ram dhatu okay you get words like viramaha which means stop so we have learned when we learned upasargas that upasargas can enhance the meaning they can give you the opposite meaning or they can keep the meaning same correct or they can give you a completely different meaning so v upasarga with ram dhatu is giving you words like viramaha which means to stop 
yeah i hope i have cleared your doubt jyotsna ji no other words follow pati shabda pati is a stand alone shabda hrasva ikaranta pullinga shabdas will follow hari shabda pati is a different shabda it's an exceptional case which is why we are learning pati shabda separately okay no other word will follow it even pati shabda when it comes in a compound it goes to the hari shabda pattern hema ji in english i don't understand what you have written both the words look the same to me please refer to your textbook what is written in your textbook is it upadanam or upadhanam so kindly look at your textbook what is there in your textbook have you seen the spelling in the textbook let me see so upadhanam was did i write upadhanam was it written as upa upa one second let me go back here where was pillow there okay it is given as upadhanam your textbook says upadhanam so we will go by what your textbook says okay it will be upadhanam so take it as a typo it should be upadhanam and not upadhanam yes yeah? uh yeah okay there is a question from uh, sanjeev mohoday he says he wants us to cover page 20, 127 from question 3 so let's go to your textbook page 127 and let us look at section 3 okay so uh, uh, i will i will uh, lower everybody's hands and i will request uh, sanjeev mohoday uh, alone to uh, keep his hand raised one second prati plus a c okay Uh, chaya ji is asking what is the meaning of the word pratyagachhat first of all you have to break the word into the upasargas and your main dhatu okay so prati plus a plus agachhat becomes pratyagachhat okay agachhat is the lung form of gamla dhatu for which the lat lakara is gachhati so gachhati is becoming agachhat so agachhat by itself means gone okay a gachhat means to come okay prati plus a gachhat pratyagachhat is to return or to come back so there is a difference between coming and returning right even in english when you say return i came from jayanagar i returned home what is the difference in the two you got it so i came from jayanagar yes. aham jayanagar atah uh, uh, agachhat agachhat i came i returned home so it's a you're going back to the base so aham graham pratyagachhat uh, pratyagacham sorry not gachhat so let's take sah okay sah jayanagar atah agachhat so he came from jayanagar सह गृह प्रत्यागछत ही वेंट बैक होम इज इट क्लियर व्हाट अबाउट प्रत्यागछत 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 विल नॉट बी देयर प्रति प्लस आ इज व्हाट इज गिविंग यू द सेंस ऑफ प्रत्यागछति मींस ओके व्हेन यू से प्रत्यागछत प्रति प्लस गछति प्रतिगछति मींस टू गो टुवर्ड्स समथिंग ओके okay thank you pratyagachhat is prati plus agachhat so it it has the same sense of pratigachhati but in the sense of past pratigachhati pratigachhami means you are going towards something so pratyagachhat is uh, to what was some i went oh, yeah on. that's all that's all it's a past tense of pratigachhati oh thank you yeah अहम 
इट इज उत्तम पुरुष यू कैनॉट से अगछत एट ऑल यू हैव टू गो टू द उत्तम पुरुष यू हैव टू गो टू द लंगकार उत्तम पुरुष एक वचन फॉर्म हम दिल्ली नगरे इज इट अगछा नो 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 यू हैव टू बाई हार्ट योर लंग लकार फॉर्म्स बाई हार्ट योर लंग लकार फॉर्म्स एंड देन एंड देन एंड देन कम विद अगछत अगस्ताम अगछन अगछ अगछ गच्छतम प्रैक्टिस इट एट होम महोदय एंड देन यू विल गेट योर आंसर प्रैक्टिस इट एट होम धन्यवाद बिकॉज एज वन इंपॉर्टेंट सेक्शन दैट आई वॉन्ट टू कवर विच विल बी टू द बेनिफिट ऑफ एवरीबडी एल्स सो लेट मी प्लीज लोअर एवरीबडी सैंस प्लीज म्यूट योर सेल्फ यू कल महोदय आई एम लोअरिंग ऑल हैंड्स राइट नाउ एंड आई एम रिक्वेस्टिंग ओनली संजीव महोदय टू प्लीज रेज इज एंड Yeah. Yes, Sanjeev Mohde, you have been unmuted. Yes, ma'am. <clears throat> Thank you. Now you so can put I... forth your question to the class. See, yeah. I won't solve the abhyasa one by one. There's no, there is no point in doing that because yeah. the abhyasa is supposed to be self-study and the answer key is given be, be, behind. But what we will discuss in class is the approach to something like this. So please yes. put your question forward. So the question is, uh, as per the textbook, is to rewrite. the sentences that have been given with tavatu ending uh, words yes uh, so like te dharmam apalayan mm. uh, so my doubt in a number of them one is some of the words i was unfamiliar with how with what is their basic form so that how do you convert it to tavatu words uh, So I that, that means is... you. I'll tell you. The first thing is, are mm -hmm. how confident are you in your lung lakara exercises? Yeah, reasonably confident. So when you know the lung lakara forms, you yeah. will know the lati rupam also. Sorry, which rupam? Lat rupam, lat lakara. Uh huh. Yes. Lat and lung. You have to be confident. Lat is present tense. Latlakara yes. is what you learned first. Yes. Correct. After yes. which, I think chapter four or something was langlakara. When was it? Chapter four or chapter five? No, chapter five is uh, lot lakara. Langlakara, I think, is chapter four. One second. Chapter four. Chapter, chapter four. four. So when you are doing langlakara in chapter four, you are understanding the dhatu, right? Mm hmm. So let's take a take pick up a sentence randomly here in this exercise. Okay. Um, In page one twenty seven, section three, pick up a sentence. So let's take the first one. Te te dharma ma palayan. Ah, huh. what does it mean? It means uh, you all follow dharma or practice. Follow dharma. now. See that's where you are going wrong. Is it follow or is it followed? Followed. followed. Sorry. Te, you so all what is the dharma. kriya padam here? To to follow or. Uh, संस्कृते संस्कृते अपालयन इति तिंगंत रूपम अस्ति ओके अपालयन व्हाट इज द लट लकार फॉर्म पालयति पालयति पालयन्ति पालयति जस्ट टेक द एकवचन फॉर्म नो प्रॉब्लम सो फॉर पालयति व्हाट विल बी द तवत्व फॉर्म फॉर पालयति इट विल बी पाल सो You all follow dharma. No, no, no. Sorry, rewrite the sentence with tavatu now. Te dharmam palitavant. Palitavant. Palitavanta ha. You have to. You have to consciously keep. 
keep away from the hindi influence in sanskrita yes. pronunciations yes. otherwise Parthi you will get that. into trouble the reason why i am saying is when you have a halanta that's when you'll say palitavant mm -hmm. palitavant there is a meaning there is a meaning for it so you have to pronounce it differently it is palitavantah palitavantah hmm okay any other uh, this thing shall we take uh, yeah <laughs> page 29 Look at uh, uh, sentence number seven. Can you read it? One twenty-eight. Sorry, I'm really sorry. Sorry, which uh, sentence number? Seven. 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 Mm. Okay. Te dur, te dur bhyasam. Aha. Pronunciation. Dur bhyasam. Te dur bhyasam. Mm. Atyajan. At. So you you see. When do you say atyajan? When there is a halanta. Mm -hmm. It's very important. Your pronunciations you have to have to have to have to work on. Atyajan. Okay. Atyajan. What is the meaning? <clears throat> so I didn't know the meaning of atyajan. Tyajati means what? What is tyajati? Don't know. To give up, tiaga. What is tiaga? Yeah, of course, yes, yes. Okay, got it. Tiajati. Okay. So for tiajati, what is the tavatu form? That is easy. Tiaktavan. Uh, Sorry. Tiaktavan. Tiaktavan. So. Tyajati will become tyaktavan. <coughs> Atyajan will become tyaktavan. Now it is te durabhyasam atyajan. So it will become te durabhyasam. Bahu chane kim rupa masti? Tyakt tyaktavantaha. Tyaktavantaha ucharanam. Tyaktavantaha. Ha. Right. Okay. Did you get it? I understood the process. Yes. Okay. This has to be practiced. So, <clears throat> one of the things I'll tell you, apart from the abhyasas that are given in your textbook, <clears throat> there is a course by Vyoma which has been done in the past called High School English Grammar for Kids. Okay, it is covering the basics of grammar. My suggestion is you don't have to go through the entire course. the exercise sections in that course you practice them the solutions are given you can refer to the solutions that will be good extra practice yes or yeah. no yeah do that so, apart from so that this is the high school uh, high school grammar for kids high school english uh, sanskrit grammar course or something it is conducted by venkat mohode venkat subramanyam mohode all right okay so there are extra practice uh, exercises over there which are very nice okay that is one option uh if you happen to go to a sanskrit bharati uh office or something wherever you stay whichever city you are uh there are publications workbooks by sanskrit bharati like for example For practice of vibhakti, they have vibhakti valeri, which is a very nice workbook. And these are small booklets, okay, fifteen rupees, twenty rupees, thirty rupees. That's the average cost of any of these workbooks. Buy them, practice them. Solutions are given there. It will be good. So for Tumun also, I think there is something called sambhashana, sopanam or something. I can't remember. I can't remember. Go through the Sanskrit Bharati website. <clears throat> Okay. so there you will see these books are not at all expensive you can order it online they will uh, send it to you by regular post okay you can use those so some of it will be slightly out of syllabus doesn't matter but about 70% with the pravesha knowledge you will be like tumun section for example you will be able to solve it even if you are able to solve 70% and the rest 30% is slightly higher standard you are actually raising the bar in your learning 
circle scale l yes yeah there are some other uh, basic learning courses for kids even in vyoma i'm not able to off handedly remember the names i think there's one course called step up with sanskritam it is probably a paid course i don't remember but there also you will find exercises <clears throat> okay yeah so it's with practice it this will come with practice only Right. Yeah, have I reasonably addressed your query? Yes, very well. Thank you so much. Thank, Thank you. you. Any Thank other you. questions? Let me just see before we wind up for the day today. Ma'am, Madhu, yes. Vikrai ka, Dhani, Vikrai ka. One one second. You can know how they. Ah, uh, Binu Binu Madhu, they had uh, asked before you. Let me just give him an. Ah, uh, yeah, Binu Madhu, Dhani, what's your question? Dhani ka, Dhanam, Abadhu. Mm -hmm. दत्तवी नो Okay. Okay. That's the one. That you okay. don't have to worry about what is the lakara. You know it is da da tu, which means it is to give. Okay. okay? okay. Your karthra you. padam is in bahu vachanam. Don't break your head. Yes. Your, in exam, yes. you won't have time to process. Correct. Okay. So I don't want you guys to get nervous and think what is adadu. I don't know this form. I won't be able to translate. No. Oh, you know okay. adadu is from da da tu. Da da tu is to give. That's the one. The karthra padam is in bahu vachanam. So it is that one thing, simple. Oh, thank you. Got it. Thank you so much. Yeah, thank you. Yeah. Thank you so yes, Yugal Mahadev. What was your question? Vikraika ha. Pratham Purush ek vachana sti to Rama sabda. Vikraika ha ek vachana sti Rama sabda vateva sti. Vikraika, Vikraiko, Vikraika. Yes. Yes. धन्यवाद it it is usually a 5 marks question or a 4 marks question the common ones are see they will give you four options okay my point is what you cannot compromise is akaranta ikaranta ukaranta pullinga strilinga napumsaka linga shabdas akaranta ikaranta ukaranta when i am saying ikaranta hrasva e and dirga e both are included okay akaranta ikaranta ukaranta pullinga strilinga napumsaka linga shabdas there is no option you have to buy it in sarvanama shabdas asmad yushmad is very similar so asmad yushmad shabdas you buy it tad and etad are similar <clears throat> so by heart that okay then you have adas which is different so adas you memorize okay idam shabda adas and idam are there this is bare minimum that you memorize over and above it whatever else you can memorize please go ahead okay so some of you who are slightly senior citizens you will struggle in memorizing so for those students i am saying akaranta ikaranta ukaranta pullinga strilinga napumsakalingas please memorize nadi shabda mati shabda is hrasvai dirghai memorize is important okay after doing that asmad yushmad is together tad etad is together and adas and 
idam <clears throat> this much you memorize this is like bare minimum okay chapter 11 is something that you go back to till kovida and beyond kovida also so that you memorize over a period of time don't get overwhelmed it is it is overwhelming sanskrit was is a magnificent language it's a very huge language and there are no shortcuts but trust me it's a beautiful experience when you start understanding your shlokas so keep it going yeah <clears throat> Yeah, sure. So Narayan Mahode has shared one detail. He says Central Sanskrit University Prathama Diksha. There is a book. He says it is very good and it is uh, it is uh, uh, this thing. Okay, uh, it is um, uh, very helpful in terms of practice. Dura abhyasam. So abhyasa is practice. Dura and abhyasa means bad habits. Why abhyasa is practice means what? You are repeatedly doing something, okay? Abhi plus asa, abhyasa. You get okay. That means repeatedly doing something, which means a habit or a repeated action. Durabhyasa, dur is giving you a negative connotation, which means I will give up bad habits. Okay? Te durabhyasam atyajan means they gave up bad habits. Okay? <clears throat> what other questions are there yeah i think with that we kind of covered uh, quite a bit in today's class i think we should close it so we'll do the shanti mantra if there are any yeah. further doubts please ask yeah what yeah. sorry i was asking about gunasyuto gunasyuti samvidhi gunasyuto thank you thank you i almost forgot that let me go back to the uh... so this was explained in um... It in the class explained. right my, my only mm. doubt is like why mm. as the literal meaning is uh, in the vyavaharika shabdas we have learned syutaha is bad bad yeah here it is guna syuta is is a fabric which has been stitched syuta yeah. usually refers to the gunny bag gunny bag kind of fabric right it's called a burlap sack in okay. english Okay. So, so that your rough, suti is like stitching. Guna suti samridha. Samridha is what the rudda datu plus samu pasarga. It is full of. Okay. Yeah. So if you see the stitching technique, okay. the way you the stitching technique that is used to stitch a chappal. If you look at the traditional way in which a cobbler, when I was small, cobblers used to stitch footwear for us. Okay, so you would go to a cobbler and he would have hand stitched chapels which you could buy. They would last long. The stitching technique is the same as what is used for a burlap sack. Oh. That is why gunasyuti samridha. So that stitching technique is what it is. See the English this thing. It's a knotting technique. Oh. So you put the needle. He has a needle which looks like a crochet needle. He puts it. and then he pulls the thread so it's a double threading you know uh, the double knotting is what happens so that is how the sacks the burlap sacks are also stitched okay so gunasyuti samriddhopi is referring to a knotting technique which is common for the padraksha and common for the burlap sacks right <clears throat> i think we will close i have covered most of the questions if i still haven't covered please raise your hand if i haven't covered any questions sanjeev mode please lower your hand because i've answered your question any other yeah otherwise we will close it for the day we've overshot our time also but doesn't matter okay i'll read out the shanti mantra assuming that all queries have been answered sarve bhavantu sukhinah सर्वे सन्तु निरामया सर्वे भद्रा पश्य कचि दुख भाग भवे ओं शाति 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 हरि ओं श्री गुरभ्यो नम हरि ओं धन्यवाद अत्र कक्षा स्थगयाम पुनः श्व कक्षा अभ्यासवर्ग 
तु शनिवासरे भवति